Hi, I'm Brendan. I'm uh, volunteering at CSCR and researching eelgrass in Coasset Harbor. Here in Coasset, we have pretty extensive eelgrass beds, uh, and it's important that they keep growing and spreading and making new beds because then they can stay healthier and not only provide an ecosystem for uh, marine life, they can slow down and stop waves from reaching shore, which helps the harbor from not eroding. And it stores much more carbon than terrestrial plants. Last year we found uh, an overwhelming amount of reproductive shoots, which are the types of eelgrass that can grow and spread seeds. So this year we were we are expecting to see more seedlings and new beds. Right, I've been looking for eelgrass seedlings to try to prove my hypothesis that new beds are forming from seeds of eelgrass from reproductive shoots rather than just from the rhizomes that go under the sand to create a new plant. And I have found new seedling eelgrass that has been that's separated from other larger beds. I didn't find any rhizomes. So that proves my hypothesis that they are uh, reproducing through seeds. Yeah. Eelgrass reproducing through seeds uh, means that there will be new beds popping up and uh, growing in different places that we didn't expect. So that's good.